Hello, I'm Paul Beckwith, and I'm in downtown Calgary. And this structure that you see in the background there is the Saddle Dome Stadium. And uh, the bridge I just crossed to get over here was actually built in, uh, after, you know, about 2015 or something like that. In 2013, there was a massive flood in this whole region. And uh, I filmed a video earlier, and so an earlier video that I posted is on Canmore, Alberta, where there was 220 million millimeters of rain, that's 8.7 inches of rain in the space of 36 hours. And all across the Rockies, you know, the far west Alberta and the Rockies, there was a tremendous rain on snow event. Many, many areas got over 200 millimeters of rain and uh, that rain that was resulting because of a blocking pattern in the jet stream okay there was a sharp ridge and a sharp trough and it was stuck in place and in the trough there was very very humid air and that humid air flowed uh, east and it uh, hit the uh, rockies and it was therefore forced upwards and as you go upwards the air cools so the water vapor in the air that was forced upward, condensed into water droplets and then clouds, and, it, and this happened days, for days on end and caused a massive rainfall event, and that rainfall event was on the snow in the Rockies. So all of that water had to go somewhere, and it entered the rivers, the Bow River and other rivers across, Mani across Manitoba, across Alberta, and it moved downstream. And, uh, you know, the, the river flow in Canmore was so extreme that it devastated areas along the banks. And then it came into uh, Calgary, that plug of water, and it covered all this area that I'm standing on right now. It would have covered all of these fields. It uh, basically took out the bridge that was here before, and it crossed over the parking lots and stuff, and it went into the saddle dome. And, uh, flooded the ground floor and enough the water height was such that uh, they should have a level here as to how high the water became but it covered the previous bridge that was here and washed it away and it, in the stadium it went uh, up it up to as high as about 10 rows of seats or something like that so you know massive flooding event you know it cut off power in a lot of regions of Calgary flooded people's homes you know all of these uh, all of these, uh, you know, nasty things happen. So this new bridge, they designed to be strong enough, they say, to withstand, you know, if that flooding was repeated from 2013, then uh, this bridge apparently would withstand that. And, you know, maybe it would. I mean, it's solid concrete. Let's have a look at the cross section of the bridge quickly. And uh, you can see some people rafting there when I filmed this is actually the second cut of this video which I never do intentionally do a second cut but I filmed the whole I filmed this whole thing a few minutes ago for 15 minutes and then you know thought it worked out well and then boom realized that I hadn't clicked or the the filming had stopped so I didn't actually wasn't actually filming as I was talking so you can see the cross section of this bridge so if the water you know, the water level in 2013 went well above the road deck because it covered this entire parking lot and went over into the saddle dome there. So, uh, you know, an equally bad flood. Um, most of the, uh, you know, the cross section of this bridge is designed to let the water just flow over it, right? Maybe they take the railings off or something so that debris wouldn't get caught and they've smoothed the sides of the bridge and it looks, you know, those are all new rocks on the shoreline and so on. So, uh, you know, hopefully, hopefully, uh, well, it may, it may be in, a, you know, just a few years before another repeat of, uh, is, of the flooding occurs and we can see, uh, you know, whether the bridge, whether the engineers actually managed to build a bridge that can withstand the uh, flooding. So just, so this area right now, I wouldn't be able to film this video in about a week because this whole parking lot will be full. They're preparing for the uh, Calgary Stampede, which opens up in about a week. And, and uh, yeah, so it's good that I'm here the, pre the prior week and I can make get access to this region. 
So thank you for listening, and uh, I'm heading up to uh, Edmonton next. Thanks a lot. Bye for now.